This place is one of the greatest places to truly experience life. Sitting in a hammock down in the river, sitting underneath the waterfall, listening to the birds in the morning or the insects at night, you'll be able to find a part of yourself that maybe have never existed. I feel so good here. The smells of kind of animals. It's so beautiful. It's my home. It's my family. Every day there is new guests. I've seen a lot of people come here and sort of revert to like childlike wonder. It's just the type of place you have to be here right. to, to see it. You can, you know it's going to be great, you know it's going to be magical, but really being here, walking through those trails and just listening to the sounds and seeing the sky change in the morning. There's no words. There's no words for it. old friends of ours or family members or whatever, like, oh, you guys moved away to be hermits in the rainforest or whatever like that. Not really, we're, we've got like a, a carousel of people coming through that we're busier than we've ever been. We meet more people than we would, you know, in our normal, you know, former existence. I came here to volunteer and get back in touch with myself and figure out what I wanted, and he ruined it, but <laughs> we hit it off really quick. I mean, really. It's the collective energy of everybody. The residents, the owners of the houses, the visitors, you know, everybody here is putting their energy in and it's just this really cool, magical thing to see all come together. We call it the Finca family and it's, it's everyone that has experienced the Finca and left their mark here. From, you know, the carpenters to the, the women that, that cook the meals with so much love and attention to detail, that is what people notice whenever they're here, is all those special touches. So many of them have been here since the Finca started, and they're super emotionally invested in it. It really is amazing watching that support grow to include new energies and new people and new talents and new specialties. Every day we are working with love. We like that the people feel comfortable here. Love is important here. This isn't our story, it was our idea, but these guys are, you know, building this dream too. And you can just see them beaming with pride when a new article comes out and we kind of throw it on the, the picnic table in our morning meeting and we're like, hey guys, you're famous again. You know, primary force, all of It is certainly, um, not been, you know, a, a, a yellow brick road of ease to create this community, but now that it is comfortable and we have water and we have electricity and we have all these things, you know, it, it's a really comfortable place. But at the end of the day, it's the rainforest that is the wow factor. It's not us or anything we built. It's, you know, the ability for people to get here, be comfortable, focus in on the cool biodiversity and the nature here. have the responsibility on our shoulders to continue to grow this place and we love the Finca so much and we believe in it so much that we take that responsibility very seriously. We're just so fortunate to be part of the community and, and part of the, the people that help to make it what it is. My initial um, entry point into Finca Bay Vista was through an internship, and I applied for the internship after my mom had passed away in 2014. 
My mother encouraged me throughout my entire life to pursue whatever I wanted to, to really go after what was a dream to me. And coming to the jungle was obviously a dream, and uh, that's why I'm here. I think she would be pretty proud. Do you think about her when you're, when you're out here? Oh, absolutely. I can tell she's watching over the house. Anyone who stays in the house is obviously guarded by one of the best people this world has ever experienced. Wow. <laughs> Doesn't matter where you're from, doesn't matter where you're going, doesn't matter where you've been. You're always welcome in my house. You're always welcome in this community. There will always be a place for you to stay. It's really nice having people come in from all areas of the world. And, and it's short stays and they're in and out of your life. And we really like it when people get attached and they have the same feelings we did when we first came here and see, see themselves living here. What? Finca asks of everybody who comes is to really, to really give a part of yourself. And not just to be there, but to really, really be there. We're not only a team, but we're family, you know, and not just with the people and the staff and the people who come and share their time here, but with the land. You come here and you rediscover how powerful wonder and awe is to feel deeply in in tune with ourselves in a way that, that has been stripped from us. We're all so blessed to be here, and it reminds you that life is such a beautiful thing. The greatest blessing in the world is life itself. <laughs>